going in for thirds. Oh my god, you're almost done. I'm chugging it. <gasps> what are these are here for? Fat. It. Go big. Go home. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Good that. Whip your hair back. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's spicy. I love heat, but that's bringing some some heat. Welcome back to Local in Seattle. I'm Kelly Hansen, and this video you're gonna love if you're a foodie and really anyone that likes to eat. So Seattle is filled with so many amazingly delicious places to eat, and I've newly discovered TikTok. I know I'm a little late to the game there, just just a smidge. There's so many viral foodie eats in Seattle, and so I want to show you my favorite three options. So today I'm in the International District, and I'm going to enjoy. Chung Chung Rice Dogs. It's a Korean rice dog. It's like a take on a corn dog, obviously. I'm obsessed with hot dogs, so this is gonna be just absolutely unreal. And of course, if you like this video, follow me for more adventures by hitting that like and subscribe. It helps me so much, and I wanna continue bringing you the fun things to do in Seattle and the fun things to eat. So without further ado, let's go. <laughs> popular Korean street food. For the batter, we use rice flour, which is what makes it a little bit special. Makes it like a little bit crispy and a little bit chewy on the inside. It's super good. And then with that, we have a whole bunch of different um, varieties for the flavors inside. You could do like a different sausage, you could do an all cheese, um, and then we have like half and half, which is our best seller. I would love for everybody who hasn't tried it yet to come out and try. This is just something, it's like a must. You have to try this. What's that? Butter. Oh. And those are potatoes, sweet yeah, potatoes uh, and regular. Yeah, how the people order. Okay. And then this is your famous rice ball. Yes. How long do they go in there for? That's five minutes. Five minutes. Are these all for me? Yes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah. That is beautiful. <laughs> this is our original, and then this one is our potato mozzarella. So this one's like really popular, customer food for sure. And then we sugar them normally. Well, it's a little bit weird, but it's just like a sweet and savory thing. It's super good. You have me at sweet and savory. <laughs> yeah, it the rice flour really well. Oh, yum. Taste test time. The big reveal. So many different options for sauces, and then five amazing options for the rice dogs. I'm gonna start with this amazing potato one. She was right, the sugar with the sweet and savory is so good. This is heaven. I think people in this park really might think that I have a problem with my five corn dogs by myself. This one is like bursting with cheese, so I know there's mozzarella cheese in here along with the hot dog. Gonna be great, why not hit it with some more cheese? Has sweet potatoes all over it. Ooh, this is gonna be messy. So many, so little time. Oh my gosh, these were incredible. I could not eat all five rice dogs, surprise, surprise. So I'm going to actually meet my foodie friend, Kelly Lee, for the next two stops. We're gonna go to Milk Drunk in Beacon Hill, known for their soft serve ice cream. I call it whippy dips, I might be alone in that, and their chicken sandwiches. All of this looks phenomenal on social media. And then another one that's kind of blowing up on TikTok, Coffeeholic, known for their Vietnamese coffee drink. So let's go before I have to be wheeled out of here because this was filling. Okay, more viral taste test today. I am in Columbia City going to Coffeeholic, which is Seattle's Vietnamese fusion coffee house. And I'm meeting my foodie friend, Kelly Lee. I feel like I'm very incognito with the sunglasses. I'll take that off. Let's find Kelly and let's get it going. I'm so excited. Their drinks look phenomenal on Instagram. <laughs> Are you excited to try these coffee drinks? Cause listen, I love coffee. I'm Vietnamese, the two together, let's do this. Coffee Holly Cows, we're the first Vietnamese inspired coffee shop here in Seattle, Washington. What are we making today? We're I've making, never been. We're making a purple haze latte first, which is an ube latte topped with espresso and our ube foam as well. Ooh. We're also gonna make a matcha latte. 
We're also gonna make our signature coffee holic dream. It's a Vietnamese style coffee with a hazelnutty flavor on top with a layer of our salted cream cheese foam. Ooh. It's our best seller. Oh my gosh. I, I look forward to work so I can come drink coffee. Okay, so our favorite part is taste test time, yes. obviously. <laughs> this one is called yeah. the Purple Haze. The Purple Haze. Shout out to Prince. <laughs> oh my god. Holy moly. <laughs> I'm going in again. <laughs> I love that this place really did a good job in like blending flavors that you wouldn't think would go well, and this is freaking amazing. This next drink that we're having is the Coffee Holic Dream. It's their most famous one. It's their best seller. It's what they're known for. You can get it with ube or without ube. And we of course got ube with it because come on. She's obsessed. After <laughs> we did the bubble tea video, it changed my life. Yes, yeah. I'm now ube obsessed. So. You know. Cheers. <laughs> drink two. <laughs> zoom in, zoom in, zoom in your face. Oh my god. This cheese foam. How many calories do you think is in here? Probably a lot, but you know what? When we get together, the calories don't count. Okay? No. I'm sorry. This coffee haul is drink the cake the cake. This is like 15 Absolutely. out of 10. Absolutely. You need more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god, you're almost done. I'm chugging it. <gasps> you have to <laughs> Okay, the last drink, number three. You know we love matcha. Had to give you a tea option for anyone that isn't a big coffee fan. Oh yeah, that's not overly sweet. They said that it wasn't gonna be sweet. It's more earthy. I gotta go back to the coffee ball drink. I was so excited to see your reaction. I'm shook. You were like shook it. <laughs> shook it. Shook it. I feel like I can stay up for three days now. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna sleep tonight. Really excited that we're going to Milk Drunk Nest. This place I've seen all over Instagram too. They're known for their chicken sandwiches yep. and their soft serve ice cream. I call them whippy dips. Why? <laughs> I've never heard of that. <laughs> we are here at Milk Drunk. Let's get drunk on some milk. <laughs> I'm super excited about their ice cream. Okay, you want a whippy dip? It's gonna stick. Ooh, there's a Nashville. You were just in Nashville too. Yes. Brine double fried Nashville hot chicken with house pickles and mayo. If that's spicy, I'm I'm in. I that. think I need that in my life. The Virginia boy has hot honey. I love hot honey. And it comes with shaved country ham. How do you feel about that? That's a lot of meat. That, I'm meaty, okay? <laughs> go go ham or go home. <laughs> the mother tip. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. We're humping out. <laughs> These things, I work out, I swear to God. Come on, Kelly. <laughs> um, I'm yeah. known to break things. <laughs> Taste test time. This is one of the bigger mozzarella sticks I've seen. <laughs> These I'm are here for fat. It. Cheers. Go big, go home. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. I love fried cheese, what can I say? <laughs> it's legit dripping. I'm taking dripping. off my jacket because it's getting that serious. Oh okay? yeah, girl? I feel like mine's heavier. <laughs> Yours, I wonder how much this weighs. Like, we could do squats before we eat it. Squat. I need, like, a hair tie. <laughs> I know, what literally. What is that? Whip your hair back. <laughs> mm. Oh my gosh, that's spicy. I love heat, but that's bringing some heat. This is so good. Bun down. There's no way of eating this pretty. No. no. Maybe don't come here on a first date. But if they love you, you know. Yeah. I feel like um, I'm a man versus food. <laughs> but woman versus food. Round 27 of eating <laughs> stuff together. <laughs> okay, so I got the cold brew coffee. And I got the swirl, so the malted chocolate and vanilla with sprinkles and a waffle cone. And this whippy dip is 10 out of 10. Everything today has been so delicious. And I feel like normally on TikTok with viral stuff, it doesn't rise sometimes to yeah. the occasion. All of these places today. 100%. Like 10 out of 10, really delicious. I see why they're viral. But thank you so much for watching. Kelly Lee, thank you for coming. Of you are course. a true foodie friend. And I appreciate you helping me eat our way through Seattle. And if you like this video, as always, please like and subscribe. 
join us on our next adventure and put in the comments where you want us to go next, what neighborhood and what restaurant, and we'll just keep doing this. It's great. Kelly Squared, peacing out. Bye.